opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center, gains more control over the e5 square, and strengthens the d4 pawn. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. Bg5 develops the bishop and attacks the f6 knight. Bg7 puts the bishop on the long diagonal in a move called a fianchetto. Nbd2 develops the knight and prepares the e2-e4 pawn push. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. Master Games It is the last book move. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is excellent. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. It is excellent. This misses an opportunity to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. This permits the opponent to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. It is good. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This kicks an opposing bishop. It is best. This allows the opponent to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores an opportunity to kick a bishop. It is a mistake. Recaptures. It is best. This connects the rooks which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. This attacks a queen, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is excellent. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. It is an inaccuracy. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This exposes an attack threatening a pawn. It is best. This move puts the pawn on a safer square. It is good. Very precise. It is best. This kicks an opposing bishop. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This is an equal trade. It is good. Takes back. It is best. This develops a piece while also winning a tempo on a bishop. It is good. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is good. This is a fair move. It is good. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. It is excellent. A very strong play. It is excellent. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This wins a pawn. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. This is the way to win a pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. This develops a rook off its starting square getting it into the action. It is best. Takes back. This threatens to activate a rook by getting it to the seventh rank. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This is an equal trade. This is the start of the end game and white is equal. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. 
right on target. It is best. The pawn is now adequately defended. It is excellent.